Hello, I'm Tom Ruggia, President and CEO of Samsara Vision, today talking to you on Macular News. Samsara Vision is a company dedicated to bringing vision and freedom back to patients who are suffering from late stage, age-related macular degeneration. We are bringing vision back to patients through a product called the Smaller Incision New Generation, or SING IMT. It's a miniature telescope implanted into the eye during uh, cataract surgery and brings vision back to people who had lost vision to AMD in the past. Uh, we are doing a clinical trial, the Concerto trial in the United States, where we're enrolling 100 patients uh, to be uh, the, the trial participants. And we look forward to working with the uh, United States FDA for uh, approval over the next coming years. Outside of the United States, we are bringing the Sing IMT to patients in Europe and Asia Pacific, where we are approved to commercialize. In fact, we are uh, closing in on our 100th patient to receive the Sing IMT, and the results outside the United States have been uh, fantastic. Encouraging uh, patient stories are wonderful. Uh, we're hearing returning back to activities of daily living like sewing, knitting, reading, watching television. Uh, but most, uh, I think, most touching to me as, as a leader in our company is when we hear that a patient can see the faces of their loved ones again and feel like a part of the family and a part of the community uh, as, as they hadn't felt that way for, for some years prior to the surgery. So it's been just a wonderful experience uh, bringing the Sing IMT to market. Again, uh, doing a trial in the United States to hopefully bring that uh, here as well. Can you tell us about the procedure? Sure. Uh, when someone has a macular degeneration and also has a cataract, uh, the device is implanted into the patient's eye during cataract surgery uh, using a small implantation device. You can actually see the lens inside the tip of this device, and a surgeon will use the device uh, during the cataract surgery uh, to just implant the device right into the uh, the capsular bag. It's a very common procedure. In fact, cataracts are the most common uh, surgical procedure in the world uh, where usually an intraocular lens is delivered into the same space uh, as this Sing IMT will be delivered to uh, for a macular degeneration patient. Uh, the procedure is, again, very common and, and, and very similar to cataract surgery, uh, so there's, there's uh, the, the surgeons are very accustomed to doing it. It's not, uh, it's not a novel uh, procedure. Uh, it's more um, um, similar to things that they already do. So we're looking again to train the surgeons appropriately. Ten of our surgeons in the beginning of the trial leading up to maybe 20 uh, surgeons by the time we finish our U.S. trial uh, and we're giving them the proper training. Again, that's in the United States. Outside the United States, more than 25 surgeons have uh, taken to the technology and, and our average uh, is more than three patients per surgeon uh, so far as we've just getting started. Uh, we, we just began our efforts to bring this to, to patients in Europe uh, in January and we've already gotten a great following uh, with our Singai IMT implanters group outside the United States. What is the implant and how does it work? It's a very, very tiny, um, if you can see this in the palm of my hand, it's a very tiny true Galilean telescope miniaturized for implantation during cataract surgery. That is the center part is a glass optic uh, and the wings or, or what looks like wings are called haptics and that's black silicone. So the black silicone uh, after it comes out of the tip during surgery will uh, unfurl into what's called the capsular bag that's created uh, when the lens is removed during cataract surgery and the, the wings of the uh, the design fit neatly into a space that locks the optic into place and allows the Galilean telescope to magnify light 2.7 times uh, around the area where the patient has lost their vision. That's called the lesion. So the lesion in the back of the eye takes the vision away from uh, the fovea and the macula. So we have sort of a parafovial centration of the magnified light, which comes with strong contrast, sense, uh, contrast ability because of the material, which is glass, uh, and the true Galilean uh, telescope uh, magnifies the light through the glass, uh, which has a pristine refractive index 
aspects allowing for magnified light to retain contrast over magnification. How can someone get involved in this trial? Yeah, we have 10 sites enrolling patients today, and uh, we are working with a clinical research organization called Aura, and we can visit them at Aura Connect. Is there anything else you'd like to add in closing? You know, I think I'd like to finish by saying that uh, Samsara Vision is a company that is just getting started, but we're based on the uh, mission to bring vision and freedom back to patients. And it can't be understated uh, that, that each of our employees at the company uh, feels a personal obligation to make the lives better for the patients that we engage with and the surgeons that we work with to bring this technology to the patients. So I hope everyone uh, feels that sense of uh, hope uh, for the future in geographic atrophy and macular degeneration. Uh, again, I, I, I want everybody to know that not only us, but there are so many companies uh, working so hard to bring technologies to market to make uh, patients' lives better. And, and we're just one of those uh, companies. And, and follow us on social media and on uh, the web as well. Thank you.